The TRX Suspension Trainer is the original portable body weight training tool that helps build muscle, increase flexibility, and heighten your core. Yes, and Karen Bunnels returns just in the nick of time to kick our booties back into shape when we need <laughs> it right. most. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. It's good to see you girls. We've missed you. Oh, thank you. Believe me, my genes have told me how much we have missed you. <laughs> yeah. Now, tell us a little bit about the TRX Suspension Training Workout Program. Uh, well, it's um, a, a gym in a little package oh like this gosh. that weighs about two pounds. And um, it's very mobile. You can really do it at home in the gym anywhere. And you can travel with it. That's the whole it's, thing? This is it. And that's what comes out of it. It's great. Oh my I goodness. I love it. And of course, you know, you use your um, core at any point when you're using this. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You can use it to assist you in your workouts or to actually make it harder. You can stretch with it. You can do cardio with it. Strength. Lots. Everything. Wow. It's so you, you hook it up to something, right? Is yes. that how it works? You hook you it up to like a... You hook it up to a beam. Okay. Or it comes with a door stop, so you can oh, yeah. put it inside of your door and great. close the door and it's mm -hmm. like stable. And it's we'll have some video and we'll show yes. you kind of what she's yes. talking about in a second. Absolutely. But now what I want to ask you about this is, okay, this is so simple, it's just a band, but then you have weights. What's the difference? Do you get the same amount of um, body buildup and muscle? Well, that's, that a, that's a good question. You know, with weights with you can make it yeah. harder by stacking the weights on. And with this, you step either away or closer to the source to make it harder or easier. So you have the option to customize. So you're actually in, in charge of the whole intensity of it yourself by just simply stepping forward or backwards. And um, I would say it's always, like I said, you're always incorporating your core and shoulders and wrists. And that's the only time this would be a little bit tricky if you had some serious neck problems. Mm -hmm. shoulder problems or wrist problems because then you wow. put a lot of tension. So you're using a lot of your own tell. body weight. Yes, that's and that's exactly what's so wonderful about it. That's so that's good a little cardio. That's where I mm -hmm. added a little cardio to it. And yeah. uh, you can even do yoga on it by... Really? You know, using oh, you're like doing assistance. mountain climbers right there. That's right. <laughs> Wait, and you can see how the impact goes away by hanging onto the straps. Karin, mm -hmm. I'm curious, that. that looks really hard. I mean, because I'm watching it going, well, you know, you're in such good shape. Would this be for everyone? I mean, is this something that if you're at a very basic level of weight training or working out, would this be something that's not possible? Or what do you no, think? No, you can do it. I, anybody can do it as long as they've had clearance from their physician. Oh, okay. To make sure that you don't have any pre-existing neck, oh shoulder, gosh. or wrist problems. You sure make it But like easy. I said, you know, the closer or further away you step away from the actual source, mm -hmm. you can make it easier instantly. And by stepping out of it, it gets, you know, you're done. So if you're in trouble, you just step out and you're, you're finished with it. So it's really, it's a great tool. And what about really for your core? It. Is, real, is it really it's good great. for your core? Always core, core is always involved. So if you're looking to get strong throughout your whole spine mm -hmm. and, and belly, this is the way to do it. Wow. I mean, it's amazing. And, and I, I would imagine if somebody comes to you for training, you'll be able to show them these individual oh, yes. exercises. I mean, what is the best way would you recommend for somebody if they wanted to get started and they're kind of wondering, I don't even know where to begin on these exercises. What would you say? Well, you know, you can go, for example, a really, really easy way to do it is to go to trx.com. Okay. And they have all kinds of videos you can watch. Mm -hmm. So if you feel comfortable doing it like that, but really it's always good to have somebody with you to help you get out of trouble if you are in trouble sure. and watch you for the fine tuning. You know. Are you as impressed right now as yeah, I am? I mean, oh, you guys are I've so done sweet. some work on them, but I, you know, that's the thing is, I didn't know that many exercises to do with them, mm -hmm. which you just show. That's a fraction. So really, and that's just a fraction. fraction. You can <laughs> really make it sport stuff. specific. Like if you're a soccer player, uh -huh. you can do little soccer drills. Oh. If you're a skier, you can do ski drills. Like I said, if you do yoga, you can do it, use it like that. You can do hours and hours on it. Well, oh, my gosh. And what I like about it, too, is being a woman, you know how you always worry about, like, I mean, you always think about, like, I don't want to get too muscular. I don't want to get too managed. But with that, it's kind of like with yoga. I mean, you're using your own body weight, and yeah. so you can really target those yeah. areas. And then you don't have to get, you could get bulky, I guess, but you Not can so scale it down. This. So you don't get, you really don't get that bulky. Yeah, this you wouldn't get bulky with just well, defined and nice long muscles. Being mm -hmm. that you said yeah. using your own body weight, would it be harder for somebody who's heavier than somebody who's lighter? Because there's less body weight to carry? Uh, it could be harder if you wouldn't adjust by stepping closer or mm -hmm. further away from okay. the source. You know, like how I explained that earlier. Sure. The closer you get to the actual uh, anchor, the easier it will be. So it will make up so for the body weight. So your goal is to keep getting further and yes, further away. Yes, exactly. Make it, make it challenging. And uh, also it really works on shoulder stability and strength and flexibility. It looks like balance so too, maybe, would always, be another yeah. major. It's really a great tool. I what, are, it. what are some of the biggest advantages, you think, to using the TRX um, straps? Again, to really work on your core muscles mm -hmm. 
and um, the, the other advantage is that you advantage is that you can really make it your own. Mm -hmm. Yeah. By, by can we can we see it real quick? Because it's right here. Might as well take a look at it. Now I want to see these grips. I mean, because so it's here's not how that you uncomfortable, hook right? It. See, here's how you hook it to your uh, source. Okay. Whether it's a beam right or the door. So that's and the hook, and then and over here's, here's your here's straps. where you put your hands in, and here's where you put your feet in. Feet in, oh. but you can see how soft oh. that is. It is soft, you guys. It's really soft, actually, and, and this is really, really cushioned it over the years. Yeah. Because it's, I think that's a concern. A well, this is good stuff. Now, Karin, how can we contact you so that way we can get? even more exercises oh. here to do this <laughs> You can find me at KarenFitness.com or KarenSantaFe at AOL.com. This is a goodie. How often uh, should we do this and how often do you do this? Great question. You know, I do it at least once a week. Okay. And sometimes I do it just by itself, but sometimes I incorporate it with other things. Okay. Mm -hmm. Jump so rope, do this. Some burpees do this, mm. you know, some weights. A little more cardio. It's a nice complement to everything else you can do. Well, that. thank you so much, Karin. And we're going to have all that website, of course, on casa.com. Coming up next, contemporary cuisine inspired by the Aztecs. Oh,